Thank you for tuning in to another episode of Devil in the Courtroom, Silent Torture, Trafficking Through Guardianship. What would you do if a loved one was forced into isolation simply so his or her money could be stolen? Senior independent adults are being forced into isolation all around this country while their assets are pillaged. It happens more than you realize. There are several states that are considered hot spots, and Michigan, especially the Metro Detroit area, is considered as such. What does that mean? It's organized crime, sanctioned by the court, full of collusion and corruption. I want to introduce to you another victim of silent torture trafficking through guardianship. This is the story of Jane Stickle, a loving woman, wife, and mother who worked very hard for everything she possessed so she could live comfortably in her retirement. Unfortunately, the trajectory of her life changed. You see, in Pennsylvania, we have devils in the courtroom. Things work a little differently for the elderly who have assets in Newcastle, Pennsylvania, especially when they fall under District Attorney Joshua Lamancusas, Lawrence County, I Care A Lot scheme. 